Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm going to show you guys how to remotely control your iPhone or iPod Touch from your computer. Uh, so first thing you want to you're going to want to do is go ahead and open Obsidia. Um, basically, you are going to search for Vinci, uh, which you can see is right there. I'm not going to bother searching it. I'm just going to show you. You guys can search it. Uh, once you're done that, you're you're going to be asked to restart the Springboard. So you know, go ahead and do that. If you don't have an icon on your desktop there, don't worry about it because that's good. You shouldn't have one. Um, if you do, you're lost. Start all over again. Um, so after that, you're going to want to go on your computer. So just give me a sec here. Where I'm controlling my iPod from, uh, you can click. You can basically click on whatever. Um, so I'll show you. I can click on whatever here, and it comes up on my phone, which is pretty cool. It's a little bit laggier on, you know, the computer, but you can still you can still do whatever. Um, anyways, what you're gonna want to do is I'll post a link in the description if you guys don't get it in this video. Um, so basically, go to your internet. Um, it's going to be soft82.com slash downloads slash windows slash VNC free edition. So you're going to go right here. You're going to hit free download. Free download right there. Okay, I already have it downloaded, so... You're going to click on Mirror 1. Let that do its thing. Um, then, once you have it downloaded, you're going to click on Install. Um, do you want to run this file? You're going to hit Run. Then it's going to prompt you. You're going to hit next. You're going to hit accept. Next. Uh, you can browse for wherever you want it, the directory to be installed. Usually it's just under program files. It'll create its own thing. Hit next. Next. Now you're going to check. This box won't be checked when you go to download. So just click that so you don't have to go to search your whole computer for it. Um, it's just going to make a desktop icon. Then hit next and then click install. Um, once again, I have it so I'm not going to install it. Okay, when you you're gonna get this icon on your desktop after that. It's gonna be VNC okay, you just can't see it. It's gonna be VNC Viewer 4. You're gonna double click that. And this is what's gonna come up. So VNC viewer, uh, it's gonna say server. To find that, what you're wanna what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna go back into your um, phone or iPod Touch or whatever. Um, you're gonna go into settings. If you don't know how to find your IP address, this is how you do it. Um, on your iPhones, probably the easiest way. You're gonna hit Wi-Fi. You're gonna hit Lloyd, and then your IP address is gonna be right here. And then you're gonna copy down that information. So after you do that, you're going to, oh, sorry guys, you're going to type that in here. So I just cut, cut mine. Uh, you're going to hit OK. Now your phone is going to ask you to remote access request. You're just going to hit accept. After it's done that, it's going to appear on your computer screen. So there it is. Um, I'll put them side by side again for you guys so you can kind of get a taste of what's coming. See, so I mean I can still move this and it'll follow on my computer. Um, or And then of course all the icons are going to be there too. You can use categories if you want to put them in folders and have it a little bit neater. I'm just going to go into notes and I'll just, you know, show you guys that. So. 
um, no notes. So I'm going to hit new. Obviously, it's going to be faster on the on the phone. Um, you're going to click there. As you can see, you know, I'm typing on the keyboard and on the phone you can see it. So you can basically do anything. You can write text, write notes, do whatever. Um, lock your phone, you know, go back to the home screen. Sometimes this, my computer is doing a lot of stuff so it's a little bit laggier. Um, but, I mean, that's the gist of it. So if you guys have not run into any problems, you know, just let me know. Um, be make sure make sure to rate, comment, uh, and subscribe if you like the video. Thanks, guys.